I start from the supposition that the world is topsy-turvy, that things are all wrong. The wrong people are in jail, and the wrong people are out of jail. That the wrong people are in power, and the wrong people are out of power. That the wealth is distributed in this country and the world in such a way as not simply to require small reform, but to require a drastic reallocation of wealth. So we have to start from that supposition that things are really topsy-turvy. And our topic is topsy-turvy. Civil disobedience. As soon as you say the topic is civil disobedience, you are saying our problem is civil disobedience. That is not our problem. Our problem is civil obedience. Our problem is the numbers of people all over the world who have obeyed the dictates of the leaders of their government and have gone to war, and millions of people have been killed because of this obedience. We have to transcend these national boundaries in our thinking. My hope is that this kind of spirit will take place not just in this country, but in other countries because they all need it. People in all countries need the spirit of disobedience to the state. And we need a kind of declaration of interdependence among people in all countries of the world. Who are striving for the same thing. 